hasn't been around a whole he lot. He has improved a lot. It's like, I'm scared to play him. He's on my side of the front. I'm oh, that's running. gonna be hype then. And you know who else has really improved is Caius as well. This man has been taking PR wins left and right recently. Like uh, I know a couple weeks ago he had a win on Mike, which is our seventh seed, I believe. I think so. Yeah. And he's actually here at this tournament as well, Mike the DDD. One of the only other DDDs uh, besides uh, Zaki that I know of who's really uh, making some waves. Uh, taking out a win on me earlier <laughs> in Ultimate's career. That clip had so many like thousands. Crazy, getting bodied by Jet Hammer. Anyways, <laughs> yeah, it's actually a, a pretty even game. What a call out on the roll back from Lycan getting that up tilt. Lycan is no stranger from getting tech chases out of Snake's down throw. He's been doing this since Brawl, so I'm sure he's excited to have it back in Ultimate. Nice call out from Kai, so. Mm -hmm. I feel All like right, the only difference, throw. aside from being a different character, Kai has more confidence now. He's not scared to like, play the top players anymore. True, because before he was pulling out the Shulk and rolling with that, but nowadays it looks like he's going Roy, which I think is a really good character for him. Someone who could just really get in your face, and actually their strength is getting up close. So you see he's putting on a ton of damage there. Perfectly even in percents, pretty much. Nice, and this is what you want to see. Against a snake, you have to cover those landings. Kai is making it so hard for Lycan to find the ground, but Lycan doing the brawl thing. The stone out the back air is almost getting the follow up with C4 as well, avoiding the up tilt. Wow, that was really perfectly timed for Caius, getting that up air. Something I have noticed from playing like him personally, when he's, okay. when he's cornered, he kind of panics. So mm. Caius can take advantage of that. I feel like he can lose. True that. One thing I also would like to see a little bit more from Caius is mixing up his juggles with counter. Because a lot of the times, if Lycan is getting juggled for too long and he realizes that up B's, pivot nades, and air dodges won't work, he will throw out a back air. Let's see how he's going to land here. Okay, that was a good, good up air from Caius just calling out the grenade pull. Running it with Nair, no punish from Lycan right there. Ooh, Kai's gonna have to be careful hitting those grenades, tagging on a little bit more damage. Yeah, I feel like right now he's feeling the the pressure of uh, being behind and he's just rushing in and he's just kind of right. him. Right. Definitely. And we're seeing a little bit more air dodges from him as well. Uh, Kai's doing a good job finding his way back on. I feel like he meant to pick that grenade up. <laughs> liking, <laughs> doing liking things. Alright, so can we see a juggle? I like the patience right there from Caius and not running into the C4, but the Nikita is going to take it. And I know Lycan really loves Nikita. That's just such a good snake tool in this game for edge guarding. I think uh, that was just unfortunate though, because I feel like Roy's up B can just reach it mm -hmm. on accident. And then that's the way he got hit. Yeah. I mean, you hate to see it happens, but if it happens, it happens. I mean, Caius was definitely doing a really good job holding his own against one of our more uh, seasoned players as well. I mean, Lycan is no stranger to the competition, and Kai's has definitely been showing up recently, so let's see what he could chop up this game to here. Going to Kalos as well. This is actually a pretty interesting pick for a Roy. I'm yeah. not exactly sure what he gets from it, aside from uh, just having a really nice flat stage. Who knows, maybe Lycan might have banned FD. Maybe, but uh, I don't know. I thought I thought Lycan would like like long stages for Snake, especially. Mm -hmm. Fair, fair. And even though that four tilt doesn't do as much damage as it did in Brawl, it is still a disgusting move to get hit by. It sounds super crunchy. All right, so we got the four throw. Nice juggle opportunity, and I really like how Lycan is just being so safe. No stranger to finding the ground once he is in the air. Pulling out grenades, throwing out back airs, just doing whatever he can to maintain that stage control and uh, go for these setups that you see him going for like right now. <coughs> the flames of the sword of the up B actually uh, connecting with the Nikita right there, canceling out the hitbox. And Lycan is just putting on so much pressure with his ledge guard here. Or ledge trap, I should say. Wow, what a four tilt right there from Kai's taking the first stock. Now what Kai's has to do is really hold this stock. I One thing that's doing a good job at uh, escaping like the um, I jinxed it. I'm sorry. Yep. Well, <laughs> you hate to see it happen. I mean, Kai's is doing such a good job getting damage and juggles, but he just one of his weaknesses that I'm seeing right now is he's not holding stocks. That, and I feel like he's letting himself get hit by grenades and he's fine with it. And I don't know why. Like he needs to be a little bit more careful. Ooh. 
I agree. Lycan definitely calling out some attacks right here and uh, approaches from uh, Caius. Like, look at that. Such clean movement, reading that roll, getting the four tilt, sending him right back off stage. I feel like a majority of the game has been played on ledge from Caius here. I'm not even sure if Caius saw that C4, yeah, but he I'm jumped like, over it. So. I was like, lucky like jumped over it. <laughs> <laughs> and an up tilt. Oh, man. Oh, okay. Is he just building up more range on himself? Wait. No jump. This is Caius' stock. Caius, I, I don't agree with Caius not jumping up there going for the juggle. I mean, I think what he was going for was like, oh, I'm just going to punish him on the ground because I have smash attacks and tilts. But Snake, you, a lot of the times when he's in the air, you don't want to go for the hard reads. You want to go for the I'm going to hit you when I can type yeah. thing because Snake's a big boy. I think it's because earlier he was doing a good job at reading his landing, so he thought he could do it again. Right. And Caius is really going to have to pay a lot more attention to these explosives on the ground. A lot of his... Ex oh. Well, there it goes. I mean, very well played from both players. I mean, Lycan just showing, uh, you know, that he is the snake main. He does have the setups. He has the stage control. He finds his landings. And Caius, although there was a few things he could have improved on, I think for the most part, he played really well. And he did